The United States arise as a superpower, but oh my God, the communists have Eastern Europe in their midst, an iron curtain's been a fix. So what? We had the technology other nations could only dream until 1949. Those kids go nuclear, 57 dread on our face. They launch Sputnik into space. We are now in second place. Civil medals ain't enough for the U.S. It ain't only about science. There's a problem this we create. Now the Russians could learn missiles all the way into outer space. They could hit any target in the United States. With Sputnik, this has started the Cold War space race. Well, we also have a rocket called the Vanguard TV. I say this for Germany The scientists really knew their thing After Allied victory A bunch were working for us But also for the Russians And in 61, Eureka Grin Became the world's first spaceman Oh no JFK knew catching up To the Soviets wouldn't do America had had enough Land a man on the moon before you can Now it's time to step our game up With Mercury and Gemini 26 billion later It's July 1969 Also Aldrin and Colin Are strapped in new place There goes Apollo 11 Into outer space Three days later I'm strong Took a small step for a man But a giant leap from mankind Cause that's what we do Well, men have made it to the lunar surface Only America's gone and done this Conrad Bean, Shepard, Mitchell, Cernan, and Schmidt Erwin Young, Scott, and Duke have also done it The race could've went forever But in 1975 The US and Russia had a much more friendly vibe Apollo and Julia's crap Linked up in outer space This signifies the end of The Cold War Space Race You may ask was it worth it But you can thank the space race for Satellite navigation And the joystick on your PS4 Thousands of daily products Were made for outer space So the winner was the whole human race. Welcome back, class. There you go, man's greatest achievement, landing on the moon as part of the space race done to Taylor Swift's Blank Space. Did you know that that completes my Taylor Swift American History parody song trifecta? Check out the first one here, Compromise of 1850, done to Shake It Off, and the second one here, The Populist Party, done to Style. And if you like it when science, specifically astronomy and history, merge together, check out my last video, The Trial of Galileo, done to extremes more than words. And if you're not already subscribed, please do so. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and if you have finals approaching, let me know what topics you really want to see down in the comments. You can follow me across all social media at Mr. Betts Class. Be safe, and I'll see you next time.